the discussion that I was having with this young man actually changed as we talked more about the next steps in his life. And he shared with me that when he recently was married, all of a sudden his mindset changed and he wanted to make sure that he was living for God. See, the verse that we talked about was from Joshua 24, verse 15. Joshua says, but as for me and my household, we will serve the Lord. Joshua is sharing here at this point in his life, and he's sharing to all the people around him, we're going to give God 100% of everything we have. We're not going to be perfect. We're not going to do everything exactly the right way. We're going to learn together and grow together with the Lord because we all serve something, but we choose to serve the Lord. So ask yourself today, where is your commitment to God? Where is your commitment to the Lord? And where's your commitment as far as the local church? Because if it's a local church that brings the hope and it's our relationship with the Lord, can you imagine what would happen if those two things converged together and your family lived that every single day? Imagine for a second how your world would change, how my world would change if we were the ones bringing the hope and bringing God's love to the community in which we live. That's what being part of a church family is about. And I challenge you today to become part of a local church family to bring that hope. Now there's still one more step and then we'll have a rest principle that we'll do together. But tonight, would you ask yourself, am I and is my household serving the Lord? It's a tough question. It's a tough answer that only you can answer and only I can answer. And we'll see you tomorrow.